others because I'm not really a star oriented kind of guy. I think all the people who we have as stars nowadays aren't Hello. really worthy of the title star. I am. I'd love to see your room. Show you room. This is my my roommate's uh, my senior year at Pitchfork State, and I want to show you my um, room that uh, is is my room right now. So let me show you around. Let's start near the door. So this is my lamp. It turns on. <laughs> <laughs> Has three different levels. Isn't that amazing? And I have my painting here. Um, I'm not really sure what to call it, but there's many different interpretations that you can take from it and see from it. So I love She's this beautiful. Little thing. I have my tarot cards here, a little bit of um, crystals, rogues, quartz, moonstone, onyx, um, uh, garnet, and smoky quartz. And I have my little bear spirit animal and my froggy spirit animal. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have some, um, uh, I was going to say medicine, it's pretty much medicine, but the vitamins, vitamins, um, a bag of candy, and some gloves and stuff. I have my beautiful trash can here. <laughs> a bag hanging um, on the door. And my jackets, my beautiful scarf. Wow. Glamorous. This is from Rick Matuk. A little over pricey, but it's a, it's a bad. Um, more jackets, more jackets, and my towel. Yeah. I have an Amazon package that I haven't opened yet, and my mirror here, and then I have um, random uh, things to eat according to the chakras, and infused water, and some affirmations. My creation station, even though I don't really create here, I create on the floor. <laughs> but um, I have all my stuff here. So, paint brushes. I have a vinyl that I was painting on. This is one of my wands that I found at my, one of my favorite places. It's all under here. <laughs> and then I have my essential oils and some more oils for my hair. For your hair, castor oil is really good for your hair. And jojoba jo ba 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 oil, and then grapeseed oil is like super good for your face and very hydrating. It could be used for your hair too. Mm. So, you know what? <laughs> um, I have my painting that I did on my chakras and stuff. Um, yeah, and then my beautiful, amazing um, poster that um, Mike Official had created. No cards of um, Sharpie art that I decided to, to create. I really wanted to build a whole wall with um, those index cards this semester, but I didn't really get around to that. So that's what we got for the wall. <laughs> and then I have a bunch of a mess here with my pens and highlighters and scissors and um, some, uh, sticky notes and notepads. I love my sticky notes. I literally, <laughs> I write on sticky notes, it's my life, because um, I just have all these ideas, so I don't have time for anyone who doesn't have time for me, what does it mean to be a master at with self-love, um, and then this one I want to put on a t-shirt so don't steal it from me, it's spread unity, peace, health, and love like a pandemic. Yes. Yeah. Amen, sister. <laughs> <laughs> and I have some more, whatever. Um, gum, random stuff, and then in here, um, I have more notebooks because I have notebooks galore. Pamphlet for the visions, um, for the video um, festival pretty much at school. I have all my spiritual learning notebooks in here. I have like three here. I have like five templates. Um, I have this gem. This is literally notorious for all my, my beginning drawings, beginning line drawings. Yeah. Some of them are up for sale, so if you're interested, if anyone's watching this, I'm be, I'd love to give you some of my notes. Free of charge, by the way. 
just let me know. And, okay. um, and I have my Board board that I literally write all my shit on, but um, I haven't really updated it. But it's okay, actually, so let me do that stuff. Um, and then in all of these, I have so much random stuff. Um, really random. Um, I have my new, um, this is a hard drive, and it's wicked tiny, and it's new, and I just got it. Um, just like a bunch of random art stuff okay that's that's what's in here and then um i have a manicure kit that was from one of my projects that i was doing um as makeup um for one of the, the films that we're doing i have another special book in there that's not for me and then i have my tassels for my lens of hiata um because i'm in the national art society <laughs> and then i have a bunch of my prints down here like i said i have a bunch of them so if anyone wants a print do you want a print you can I do i would love one if you want one um i did i was selling them but i have new new art and stuff that i want to actually sell so um i'll be happy to get some previews away and then i have my little lander paeta um pin thing that i'm gonna wear for a graduation yeah. i don't know if it's gonna go this but that's okay that's okay it doesn't have to do that. And then some paints and some incense. Literally, each one of these drawers have incense in them. Um, yeah, my Google Head, um, Rolling Stones magazine, and some doodling. Um, more incense. This is pretty much my incense drawer. And then my beautiful um, Grateful Dead um, bandana that I got at the concert. It's really, really cool. I couldn't afford a t shirt, so. Actually, no, I did get a t shirt. It was like 20 bucks. I got it like in the parking lot. <laughs> So, yeah. Oh my gosh, some stuff in there. And then some complex random stuff. Um, this is a, I want to paint this and make this for, as a, um, a crystal grid thing. So Ooh. I'll paint it and then like um, put the crystals here with the grid and all that stuff. So it's like a travel kind of thing too. I have all my paintings. This one's my favorite right now. This is String Theory. Isn't she cute? She truly AF. I have my Dumbo one. Animal. I used to love this movie as a kid. It's kind of contradictory um, in society, <laughs> but it is what it is. Um, and this is um, Dragon Stripe Molecules and Thought Bubbles Constellations. So um, you can ponder about that for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I have some unfinished paintings that I'm still working on. Um, this one is a symbol for something. If you can guess what it is, you can guess what it is. I'm not done with it. I want to kind of make like a wormhole for that. Um, and then this is, oh, I have some more things. You have to like really go in depth about these because there's like so many different ways of looking at them. And then this one was a project for my human communications class. This was um, my book of life story. So family, friendship, and love, and growth, and all that good stuff. Yeah. In the electric and magnetic fields, of life and then the beyond. So that's life yeah. for me so far, I guess. With all the alphabets, with the whole word, you see there's like little words, with, um, the whole alphabet's in here actually. And like that's pretty much what makes up the communication in our world as English speakers. So I'll put that in there too, you know, just for a little ha ha ha. And yeah, so those are like my paintings. You can check more of them out on my our Instagram. <laughs> I have my memorial books up here. Uh, I have so many uh, not books. Uh, this one is for poetry. This one is for my spiritual awakening. This one is for um, my semester one at school senior year. And then this one is my yoga one. This one is what is this one? Oh, this one is my spiritual learning, and then this is my ancestor book. And then my ceramics tools and my pants and stuff, my jeans up there. Mm. And then my beautiful Red Hot Chili Peppers poster. Gotta have that. Yes, I <laughs> love it. And I have more unfinished paintings over here. I'm not gonna show you them yet because that's a surprise for when I finish them. And then I have some more paintings over here as well. Love them. I have more to, more to work on because I have so many unfinished projects. 
Um, I have my red light therapy light here. It's super cool. It um, is really good for your cell health and for your overall um, health in general. It's supposed to, to like regenerate cells. It's supposed to get rid of like, scarring and cellulite and like, improve your skin and stuff. It's pretty pretty cool. It's really bright. Not much like <laughs> bright right into it, but so we have these goggles right here. Love that. Um, I have all my shoes here. And then I have my plants up here with my medicine bowls. I do call them medicine bowls, but they're um, singing bowls. <laughs> they're pretty much medicine bowls too, I guess you could say. Um, I have my mess of my self-care stuff. Uh, mostly my hair stuff is here and um, for the shower and then for out of the shower and my, some of my skin stuff and some nail polish and masks down here, hairspray, my makeup that I have here is down here. This is a project I'm working on too. This is um, just like moss and I'm gonna put some flowers and this cardinal on it and it's gonna be fun. But yeah, I have my makeup and then my hair tools back there. And then up here I have my makeup brushes and perfume and lotion, more hair stuff, more face lotion, um, and my Q-tips and cotton pads. I need more cotton pads actually, and more makeup and stuff. And this is my cool light that makes um, stars and stuff. I could have gotten a cooler one, but um, it's a Walmart $20 one, so it does the job <laughs> for what I needed it for. And then um, crystals, my crystals. Bags. I made this in ceramics class. It's just a little bowl. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Yeah. It was fun making. I have more, um, but but I still have to finish them. This is like actually my creation station where I, I leave all my my stuff. I have my fairy charms book that we were looking at earlier. And then my um, speaker. These are my Posca markers. Yeah. I really love those. <laughs> And then I have more, I have Sharpies and pens in here. Yes. And then I have my line drawing notebook down here, which I can show you a little bit. I haven't, it's a little dusty actually. I haven't really picked this one up in a while, but. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. I'm working on this one. And then this one has some more too. Um, and then. And then I have so many beads, as you can tell. Many different strands of beads because I want to make some more necklaces because I make necklaces and little trinket things for hair and for um, like um, keychains or just like little talisman things. It's fun. And these are like some of the necklaces I've made. I'll just show but a few of them. Um, this third eye, or not third eye. This is an evil eye necklace. It's a little choker. Love this one. Um, and then this one is very special to me. It's a moon and a moth. And if you know, I have a, a tattoo of a moth here and a moon right here. So uh, some like stars and stuff on it. So special. And then I have this fairy necklace. It's once upon a time. This is like my unicorn necklace pretty much. It's like a choker too. And it has like a little fairy on it. And then this is my fairy necklace, my infamous fairy necklace that connects me to the, to the other world that I created with the fairies. It was fun. And then a um, little ocean mermaid necklace. It has mermaids and a dolphin on it and a compass sign for when I want to go diving. You know what I mean, you know what I'm wearing. <laughs> And then this is my Lionsgate necklace, stepping into my power from a portal. Yeah. I like to have stories on my necklaces because it's fun. And this is my peace and love necklace, key to peace. Peace and love. Peace and love. <laughs> and then this one, oh, this one's just um, the tree of life with a bunch of like angel-esque ascended master vibe to it. Yeah, so those are the ones I have here. Love those. 
This is my plants and more crystals and then another painting and this all night thing. I have some incense cones. This is a, a little scroll that I found in the forest. It has some good vibes to it. This is my manifestation um, water juice that I have been charging under the moon for the past few months. So it extra charged with all those cycles and phases. And my, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one Beatles poster. I used to have like a bunch of, um, uh, what do you call it, affirmation stickies up on this this pole here, but I took them down. I don't have, they're all in my notebook. Um, so yeah, I would put like affirmations like every day on the, the wall so I can wake up and like look at all my affirmations and remember who the fuck I am because I forget sometimes. <laughs> and then um, my uh, wall of um, whatever you call records that I've created. You don't have to figure out the meaning of them. That's for me to know and you to just guess <laughs> and assume. And then I have my own symbol over my bed. Over my bed. And this is my bed. <laughs> me posing, not trying to be awkward, but like. I'm <laughs> doing it anyways. I have my stuffies, stuffy animals. This is Bunny. This is my baby that I've had since I was born. So this is literally my first love. Don't fuck with her, I'll fuck with you. <laughs> don't. If you don't have a stuffed animal, then um, uh, you're neglecting your inner child, first of all. Second of all, this is my elephant. <laughs> and then this is my light my fire um, dragon thingy that I got on Valentine's Day. Down here, I forgot that I have snacks. I have snacks and my protein powder, and I have my water case. And then my backpack filled with my books that I take to the library. I told you I have so many freaking notebooks. So many of them with my different purposes and everything. And this, this is just the ones that I have here at school, let alone my other two ones. Because um, my mom and my dad live in different places. So, and then, I don't know why I'm showing you this. This is a random bag. I mean, I use this bag for my for for school and stuff i have random notepads and my gratitude journal on here this is gratitude journal which i need to add more to there's so much to be grateful in life so much um my uh what do we call it my laptop usually stays here this is my yellow sweater i will go into that at another time and down here we have stuff under the bed um, I have random crates and baskets for who knows what the fuck for. Um, well, really, just kidding myself. I just feel empty right now. <laughs> um, and then I have this thing. This is like I have my camera and my laundry detergent stuff. Um, really, not some like interesting stuff. In here, I used to have my books, but I already brought them home because I thought it would just be easier for me that way and just like keep a few of them that I'm actually reading here um, because like we're moving around and I just thought it would be easier to move my book home. More random shit that you don't really need to see or care about because it's just random shit that I have there. And then we have my altar slash um, nightstand. Um, it changes all the freaking time. This is what it is today. My poetry book. I have all my crystals. This is one of my trinkets. Uh, one of my trinkets slash uh, talesman thing that I just made. And then some other necklaces. And my kind of crystal grid that's a little old. Needs to be changed now. Um, yeah. Good vibes. Good vibes. Good vibes. And then this is my creator uh, paintbrush that I found somewhere. And I was like... Is the universe telling me to create something? And I was like, maybe. So we just like added that there. And we have some perfumes and stuff. Cool. And then my really cool like light that likes to change colors and <laughs> stuff. And then my insanely filled dresser with all of my fucking clothes. I have so much of it. Yeah. Um, and then over here I have more books. I have a lot of books. More books, another notebook. 
more books and then my yoga wheel and this back um, aligner thingy and then that's like pretty much it. Um, I have my yoga shoes that I love so dearly. I think that's like pretty much it. Well, thank you for showing me your room. Yeah, well, thank you for being here and being interested in seeing my, my cool freaking MTV uh, room. You know, it's, it's a blessing to be on the show, honestly. Like, it's it's totally like the high vibe shit that I'm going for all the time. Yes. Cool. Well, now get the fuck out of my room. <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh.